This is the piece of land under dispute. The land which has since been fenced off has been a source of tension between matato operators along Kangundo Road and a private developer whom they accuse of grabbing the land. According to the matato operators, the piece of land near Kayole Junction has been a bus stop for years until recently when the private developer fenced it off. We had a mutual uh, agreement whereby our vehicles operate within the road reserve but leaving other stakeholders to use the main highway along Kayole Junction. But this has happened to be that in one way or the other they have actually closed the area. It has become a, either a garage or a parking bay for trucks. They claim the private developer who plans to construct a petrol station on the controversial land has been using security agents to harass them whenever they raise complaints. Now, how comes now already they have constructed those uh, stone uh, things? They are telling you that now that one is temporary and they have blocked us access to any stage from there. The other thing is harassment by the police officers that we are ferrying passengers from the highway. But this has been brought about by the conflict of interest in doing our business. What we are asking is, can Hakim and marked this particular area sometime back in February? Because they, have, they are not able to control their matatus. In fact, as I told you, these are officials. I've never seen them here. I work with other people here who man the stage, who write the receipts. They are other different people, all right? So they are not able to manage their vehicles. They have so many vehicles. Once Nairobi Area Kenya National Highway Authority's Deputy Director, Engineer Andrew Maiteka, says the land is a road reserve and should not be interfered with. You want, I have said, if you say you must have the parking here, I use clause 13, I revoke his access, close it and put for you the parking. He won't those who have an appetite for public land that they will not have their way. Samson Kitavi, Lunchtime News.